think he'll come back to pitch again? At this point, I don't know. At this point, I don't know. Uh, we have to face this first. Does part of that depend on how long the rehab and all that kind of stuff? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, that depends on how the rehab is going to happen. You know, from there, we see. We were just listening to Mariano Rivera. He is the Yankees' legendary closing pitcher. He's sidelined his career, maybe in jeopardy for good, after injuring his knee yesterday in a freak accident. We're going to talk right now to Dan Barbarisi. He is with the Yankees in Kansas City. Dan, give us a sense of what happened yesterday and on the field for people who haven't seen this and, and don't know what just happened to Mariano Rivera. Yeah, it was really one of those freak things, as you said. Uh, pitchers normally hang out in the outfield during batting practice while the hitters are practicing, and they chase down fly balls. Rivera has done this for 20 years, and he went back to go uh, run down a fly ball very close to the wall. He caught his foot uh, right on the area where the grass and the uh, dirt intersect, kind of tweaked his knee and fell right down and writhing in pain. Uh, from that point on, everybody knew something was really, really wrong, and after the game we found out that he torn his uh, ACL and his meniscus in his knee, and chances are this is probably it for him. Now, for people who don't know how serious of an injury that is in baseball, put that in perspective. I mean, they, they, they think that, again, after a career where he's had 608 saves, I think that is a record, that something like mm -hmm. this, a tweak in, in the knee, that, that could do it. Well, the thing is, if he was a younger guy, say if he was 25 years old, this probably doesn't end his career. But he's 42. He's been talking about retirement anyway. And now he faces with a likely year-long recovery just to get his knee back to where it is, to say nothing of whether he would be the same pitcher at that point. It's just a question of whether he wants to do that and whether his body at this age can really hold up to that. He's already defying every bit of medical and sports science to be as good as he is at this age. But he's a guy who was probably going to step away at this point at the end of the year anyway. So I would honestly be surprised to see him back next year. The Yankees losing last night uh, after this devastating blow with Rivera, lo losing last night to the Kansas City Royals. What are you hearing from the team uh, and the manager there? They're honestly devastated. You know, they, they to be in that locker room after the game, you know, I've been there after they've lost playoff series. You know, these guys have lost World Series. I've never seen it like this. It was honestly like somebody died. But the mood was just so heavy. These guys were so blown away by this. They look at Rivera as some, somewhat of an invincible figure, you know, a patriarch, a father of the whole team, and somebody who the normal rules don't apply to. So, so to see him so human and so broken, I think, was hard on everyone involved and all these guys who have looked up to him for so many years. He's been with the Yankees, I think, 18 years and 97. He took over as their closer. People may wonder, why was a pitcher, why was the closer out there fielding balls to begin with? I mean, it's just part of baseball tradition, and, and Rivera actually is such a graceful athlete that it's one of the things he does really well. He had joked a lot of the time that he wanted to play an inning in center field before he retired. Um, you know, it's, it's almost a sad thing, but uh, obviously he's never going to get a chance to do that now. It's one of those things that I think a lot of people are questioning right now to say, hey, we baby these guys and treat them so well as athletes. Why do we let them run around out there like this? But it's definitely an entrenched part of baseball culture, and, you know, this really is a freak thing. Rivera's done it for 20 years without incident. So it's one of those things that, yeah, you can definitely second-guess it, but uh, it's a big part of what they do every day in baseball. And, Dan, is there a possibility of rehabilitation so he could come back at least partially for a season so that the end of this unbelievable career in any sport and for any athlete could end differently could end on a better note you don't want to say anything's impossible so i'll just say it's highly improbable that he could come back this year he absolutely could come back next year if he wanted to i'm just not sure the desire is there at this point when he was probably thinking about hanging it up anyway